Hey kids, it's time for another episode of Kitty Cat Gaming with your host, Mortimer! KKG! KKG! Yay! <laughs> hey everybody, welcome back to another exciting episode of Kitty Cat Gaming. Found, I'm back with Aaron. I found the prisoner. And we found the prisoner! He is ready for some, ripe for the helping. Right, yeah, he's like, please, please help me. Freaking oh. Yaku Obu is the is the blight of my existence. Is this the only prisoner you have to save? Yep, it's just one guy. He's like, please help me. They've only been feeding me cabbage, Shit, and my to... farts are insane. <laughs> Stop it! I'm trying to put him down, not pick up a gun. God, freaking. The, that's the downside to uh You know what the you know what the true question of this game is? What? Why is Snake working as a military personnel when he could be a model? Um, because all he knows is war. Haven't you ever played three or Peace Walker? Yes, I have. Which we literally just played? Yes, but I'm just saying look at that butt. Uh I get that his butt is very nice and all. However, uh, you gotta understand, mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. he is, uh, a warrior by blood. Yes. He's devoted to the boss's ideals. Yes. As, as he interprets them. The freaking, I just dropped in a hole. <laughs> the boss is a cool lady. Yeah, she was pretty rad, right? I would, I would play a Metal Gear game that was just her. Like, it was like a old, like, 60s Metal Gear, and you get to see what the boss was like. Well, it'd be the 40s, because her, her big, uh, her big mission was World War II. Mm, that would be cool, man. Yeah. A World War II Metal Gear game? That would be pretty cool. About the boss. Yeah. That'd be rad. Get on that, Konami. Well, they're not making games anymore. No, nah, they're gonna make another Metal Gear game. I don't know. They're just not gonna do it with They're Kojima. shutting down all their studios. I heard that they're still doing it. I could be wrong. Who knows? But I hope they are. Let me hope. Let me dream. How did I not get him? I mean, look at all those scars on your arms. Oh, does he have a helmet on? I got him. Cool. What the hell? I just fulton these guys. The same did thing. I not just fulton these three guys you in totally front of the did. in front of the base? Yeah, they just respawned. The hell? I mean, I'm fine with getting more guys and all, just but get like, get out of there before you die, please. She's Louise. I mean, I finished the side up, so we're Snake, good. Run, Snake, run! Run! Frick, man! Oh my gosh, Snake, get out of there. Hold, dig in and hold out what you got. You need to go back to my base and take a shower so you can be mentally refreshed. Bro, thanks for that. Thanks for the reminder. I like this, after he gets on D-Horse, there's an animation of him adjusting his nuts. What are you talking about? After he gets on D-Horse, he kind of like lifts himself up and shimmies. Well, yeah, I mean, he's got a he's got a big swinging dick. <laughs> he's just got to reposition it so he's not fucking... If you've ever rode a horse, you know what it's like. Yeah, it sucks. It I rides like, up all I like your... riding horses, but it is very painful. You hurt for like the whole next day. Yeah. Your legs are not meant to be in that position for that long. Yeah, it's pretty rough. I don't know how people do it professionally. Like, I guess after a while, you must just get used to it, but... Well, you can wear special pants for it, and... Cause, like, it hurts. This and that. I yeah, used to go horse riding a lot when I was growing up, and I really enjoyed it. Did you? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. That's nice. Yeah, it was nice. I rode a horse named Tigger. <laughs> what? Yeah. His name was Tigger? T -I -G -R. What if what? I tranked the horse? I don't know, do it. Not in the face, though. But that'll be most effective. Yeah. <gasps> he's a sleepy horse. Oh god, that <laughs> feels bad. No, he's, he's just taking a nap. <laughs> Susie's just napping, he's tired. He's been running around bad. all day. It feels bad. No, he's I don't a nap. Like he's it. a nap. Oh, oh he's, he's awake, again. he's awake. Okay. He's like, don't do that again, Sneak. <laughs> I love you. I love you, D horse. Oh. Oh, it's Pequod. Blow a kiss to Pequod. Pequod. <laughs> Oh, Pequod. <laughs> man, is fucking Dee Dee ready to come on missions yet? I don't know, man. I gotta, I gotta beef up my R&D team first, and then we can talk. Go back to my other bits and take a shower. Freaking, do I have to do everything around here? Mm -hmm. Gosh, arg. Is that like a Charlie Brown thing? <laughs> arg. Arg. <laughs> I'm just gonna steal everything from everyone. All right, that's what I'm gonna do now. I'm just gonna steal Boy. all of the high-level guys and put them in R&D, because that's Great. what needs to happen. Yeah, you need more stuff. 
I need a missile launcher, or else I can't move on. Yeah. It's BS, and I also need a bigger R&D platform, but I didn't have enough materials, but maybe I do now. You just need to start folding trucks and shit. Susie, I can't do that unless I have a bigger R&D team. Oh, great. Yes. I don't want to zoom in on Snake's face. Stone worm. You only got one guy? What? I got plenty of guys. Uh oh. All right, R and D is at nine. Seething iguana. I have I can have forty people cooter. now instead of thirty. So, so you know how they pick out their names? How's that? When they come to mother base, they're in a room with Kaz, and Kaz uh, has a dartboard with like <laughs> mammals and animals around the edge. Why does this sound like your fan fiction? And uh, he throws darts at the dartboard, and whatever they land on is what they name that person. Because you know Kaz is like blind or whatever. So he can't really or see. Whatever. Yeah. They just kind of also let spins cause around in a circle and then cause throws. And so, you know, sometimes they might hit the guy, but that just, that's a good indication that things are going to go great. You yeah. Know? Yeah. I get you. Yeah. So that's how they pick their names. No, I think you're right about that. Yeah. All right. Crying eel. What is a gibbon? A gibbon is a bird. Is it? Yeah. Dizzy ram. Oh, that's cute. Killer sloth. Oh my God. That's Ross. <laughs> Why is that Ross? Because he's so lazy. Oh. <laughs> but he's mean. <laughs> he's a good bite. You know what I mean? <laughs> I guess so. Flaming vulture. I guess he Howling does have a good bite. Buffalo. Copper right. moth. Sorry, That's cool. I'm gonna steal you. Blue oh, kangaroo. I'm gonna steal you too. Devil ox. Lonely wasp. God, these names. <laughs> They're a joke all on their own. Are you enjoying the names? Yes. God, I'm there's like, like uh, fucking... there's things online where you can right. randomly generate your own Metal Gear game. Alright, good. I moved Miller, but I have to move him back. I'm gonna develop. Oh, thank God. Alright, I'm gonna get a freaking explodey. There was a thing online where you could make your own name. Yeah, I think it's still there. Is it? Yeah. Cool. We should do it. We should find out what our names are. Let me see if I can find it. Done. Because I want to know what our yes. what our mission names are for the Sons of Fat. Sneaking effing suit. Let's see. Metal Gear name. <laughs> Never just name generator popped up. Uh, Phantom Cigar. And what else do I want? What else do I need? The Burkov. Anything? Nothing? All right, cool. All right, start by picking one below. You are a Foxhound agent or a ranking? A I ranking? I don't know what that is. I guess I'm just going to say Foxhound agent. Now I'm enter your name and click up. the button. You want to be on Foxhound or you want to be Sons of Fat? I want to be Sons of Fat. That's right. Oh, come on. All right, so now I'm going to auto assign all staff. Okay. Stop. Oh, Done. God, I didn't click on that. Stupid cool. ads, they pop up everywhere, Done. man. Done. Got it. Woohoo! All right, on to occupation forces. Thank goodness. Thank freaking goodness. Right. Wait, where do I have to go? Uh. uh Eliminate the curls, we reinside to Soccer E Village to Smase Fort. Wow. My name is Intense. Tanks. Oh, jeez. So, my mission name is Thunder Mantis Badger. Whoa. What is my name? Let's see, let's see. Thunder Mantis. Oh, I didn't take a shower like you wanted me to. Oh, no! You go back, go back and take a shower. Oh my god, are you Because you gotta refresh yourself mentally. Alright, fine. I'll go back to Mother Base, I'll punch some guys. And I will refresh myself mentally. So I'm Thunder Mantis, and you are Martial Arts Pain? Really? Martial Arts Pain? Yeah, that's not an animal name, though. That's, uh, that's pretty straightforward. Alright, let me- there's gotta be a different name I'm Martial generator. Arts Pain. My martial arts will cause you pain. My punches and kicks are not to be reckoned with Here because they hurt when they hit your face and body. Oh shit, is this a D-Dog animation? I think this might be D-Dog. Oh no! Oh, there's Oh no, it's Ocelot training soldiers. Oh, yes. And then he says all that shit about engravings. It's because you're not coming to base enough. No, this is just this is happens. Yeah. Fire, Why fire is he like wearing that. Gloves. It must be fucking insanely hot there. He's wearing gloves and a scarf. Well, that's his thing. He's a cowboy. On a steel horse, he rides. You see that in the He's movies. wanted. You see that in the movies. Dead or alive. That's an automatic. Oh. Don't bother trying to dampen the recoil. Oh. You do that with a revolver. Oh damn! Did you learn that from Snake? We diamond dogs. We diamond dogs sometimes have to take a shit. 
Where you want to do it doesn't matter because we're dogs. Oh my god. You can take a shit on the floor right here if you want to. I don't care. I don't talk. You'll learn how a real soldier fights. How a real soldier shits. Where he stands. I'll show you right now. <laughs> he just unbuckles his big belt. Oh my god. And pulls down his pants no! that are like one size too large Stop! for him. And then he's just like, uh, there we go. Yeah. Shitting like a real diamond dog. <laughs> oh my god. That's gross. <laughs> oh, his eyelashes are so beautiful. Alright. Alright, so I found a new generator. It's random. Alright. Hey, what's up, big boss? You like all that talk about shitting? Me too. Huh. Wish I could shit like he could. I really love a good shit right now. Alright, so do you want to be Foxhound? Cobra? Let's see. I'll tell you next time on Kitty Cat Gaming. All right, next time we're gonna we're gonna figure out what our animal base names are. Be sure to hit that subscribe button so you guys don't miss it, and we'll see you guys all next time. Bye, everybody. Goodbye.